Close Around the House. In this video I'm going to give you a quick overview and demonstration of the Tommy Tippy Closer to Nature Microwave Steriliser. Just to show you what you get in the box, you get four Tommy Tippy Closer to Nature 260ml bottles with four rims, four teats for the bottles, four lids to put over the bottles, you get a set of tweezers to remove the items from the steriliser when you remove it from the microwave. You get the base which you put your water in, you get your tray which you attach the items to, and you get your lid which you attach firmly over the base when you put it in the microwave. The first thing to do is add 200 mils of water to the base. And you can see there we've added water exactly up to the 200 mil mark as per the instructions. So add your 200 mils of water to the base. Then take your tray and place that inside the base. Then get your bottles, place them face down in these circular grooves which are designed to place your bottles in like so. Then you need to assemble the teat into the rim of the bottle in order to place it in these grooves on the tray. Do this by placing the teat into the rim like that. When the teat is placed firmly and secure into the rim, these can then be placed into these grooves on the tray by here. You just hook the teat over the groove like so and the teat and the rim can now hang in the air. We'll do this for the other three. Then take your bottle lids and place those over the raised section in the middle. These can be stacked directly on top of each other like that. Finally add the set of tweezers and they can just go in in a gap in the middle. Taking the Lydia sterilizer Place it gently over the base, lining up the two holes either side of the lid with these two grooves on the base. That will then slot like that into place. Make sure these are both secure before placing in the microwave. According to what power microwave you've got, you'll need to leave this in for different lengths of time. If your microwave power rating is up to 800 watts, you'll need to leave this on full power in the microwave for 8 minutes. If your microwave is anything from 850 watts to 1000 watts, you'll need to leave this on full power for 6 minutes. If your microwave is rated 1100 watts or more, you'll only need to leave this on full power for 4 minutes. When the microwave stops, leave it for 5 minutes to cool down before you remove it, and when you remove it, make sure you use a tea cloth or an oven glove, because it will be piping hot. Right, let's get this in the microwave. I'm going to show you a table of the microwave times based on the power of your microwave now to save you rewinding this video. So I've left it for five minutes, it'll still be hot so we want to use an oven glove or a tea cloth or both. Make sure you place this on a heat proof surface because it is hot. Now being really careful, lift the lid off, face it away from you and you'll see the steam rise off that. All your bottles are now sterilised for up to 24 hours, leaving the lid on in between removing bottles. Your upturned lid can be used as a sterilised surface for placing your bottles in for preparation. Just place your lid back over the base to keep your bottles sterilised for the next 24 hours. And you can leave those on the worktop, covered, until you need to use them. So there we go, that's how to sterilise bottles in the Tommy Tippy Closer to Nature Microwave Steriliser. I hope this video was useful. For more DIY tips, tricks, how-to and review, Please subscribe to Pirates Around the House. Ta-ta, farewell.